mean to be harsh on Gary, but yeah. uh, I'm wondering if people are really in denial. I mean, if you like to, if you're a man and you like to mess around with other men, there's nothing wrong with it. Right. Yeah. But wouldn't it be Amen. better? Amen. But but wouldn't it be better? Because I'm attacking now, Gary. Simply to admit to yourself and whether you admit to others that's your choice that you're at least bisexual. If you mess around with men and women, you're bisexual. If you mess around mostly with men, then you're gay and there's nothing wrong with it. But if you deny it to yourself then I would think that could cause a problem. Yeah, yeah, that, that answers it. I don't mess around with women. It's just about the male's body that revs my engine, Danny Cotton in the loft. I'm sorry? Just something about the male's body. Like, I don't, I used to be into the girls, but now more, I just, I, I, something about it just changed. Well, let me just encourage you, Gary, to be who you are, whatever you Thank are. Thank you, light the fire, my friend. And, and uh, no, I appreciate that. But I, I, the only thing I'm concerned is that um, people like Gary, don't get enough support in our society. Oh, I think that's true. Amen. That's true. And it's very hard to admit these things. I think Gary may have a problem that if he says he's bisexual or sometimes had, has, has had gay experiences in a society that tends to say you're either gay or straight, he will be slotted as gay. So he'll be identified in his peer group as gay. One of the things I've noticed, uh, particularly with young do you mind if I ask you how old you are, Gary? How old? Oh. 18. 18. Perfect. What I've noticed, and you tell me if you think I'm wrong, that particularly with people who are about 18 today, my, my generation is Generation X. This is Generation Y. This is right. the next generation. People from about, let's say, 15 to 25, they're almost beyond these labels. Gay, straight, bisexual. If they like someone and they want to mess around with someone, they do it and, you know, labels be damned. That's an increasing trend, apparently.